How are you getting on? Oh, I can't complain. I'm glad to see you back on your feet. Yeah. Thanks a lot, Henry. Your hunker told me all about how you helped her. And actually, me too. It's incredible. All the things that happened. You're right there. I'm in your debt, Henry. For both of us. Ah, uh, don't mention it, Matthias. You'd have done the same, wouldn't you? Of course I would. See? Next time I need help, I know who to come to. <laughs> anyway, what else is new? What about your hanker? Well, she has to go to St. Martin's to do penance every day. Ah, uh, you know that's not what I'm asking about. Uh, uh, yeah. It's all good. Of course, she's very busy. And me too. But we'll go dancing together next time there's some feet here. That is, I'd like to. If she would too, but she's a bit ashamed. Why? On account of the preaching and the court and everything. She's worried about being among people. Ah, I see. Well, that'll pass with time, believe me. Johanka went through some very difficult trials. You mustn't rush her. You understand, don't you? Yeah. You're right. So what will you do now, Matthias? Or the two of you? I wish I knew, Henry. For now, I'll work in the monastery grounds. Maybe even on the construction. Until they throw us out. They don't want to let you stay here? Well, it seems the abbot isn't happy about so many lay people right outside the monastery walls. Nicodemus is trying to put a word in for us. And for Adela, too. But the abbot can be very obstinate. He wasn't happy about your hunker being here at all. And then, with all that happened after... I see. So what will you do if you have to leave? I really don't know. We'll stay until harvest, at least. There'll be plenty of work, and then... We'll see. Maybe we can find jobs somewhere around here. But more likely we'll go away to other parts. If we can save some money. I don't know where, though. Well, you ought to at least get a place for the winter, though. But I can't promise anything. But if the right moment comes up, I'll put in a word for the two of you with Sir Radzik. He might need some people in the stables or the kitchen or whatever. We'd really appreciate that, Henry. Thanks. For everything. The Lord be praised. What brings you to me? Sir Radzik? That is, father. I wanted to ask something. What do you need, son? It's about Matthias, a friend of mine from Scalitz. He's now recovering from his wounds at the Sassau Infirmary, but they won't let him stay after harvest. And his sweetheart, Johanka. Soon she'll have nowhere to go either. So, I was wondering if maybe you could give them some job? I'm sorry, Henry, but I can't take in everyone from Scalitz who has nowhere to go. Just for the winter, sir, please. Matthias's life was hanging by a thread. And then there's his sweetheart, too, Johanka. The Inquisitor tried her for heresy, but she was cleared. She really doesn't have it easy. I heard something about this business with Johanka. You were there for it? I was, but it's a long story. All right. You must tell me about it sometime. As for your request, it's good of you to want to help. Let them come after the harvest. Thank you. You won't regret it. Matthias won't lose any swords. <laughs> All right. Run along now. Goodbye. Good day, Henry. Great job. Greetings. I came to an agreement with Sir Radzik. He'll be expecting you after the harvest. Thanks a lot, Henry. You're a real friend. Take care. <laughs>